Hi everybody, uh, this is Gia from Thinking Canine, and today I'm going to do an unboxing uh, with my bird. His name is Atlas. He's this little green thing right here. Want to come say hi? Come here. Hi. Good bird. Um, Atlas is a BB parrot or a canary wing uh, parakeet or canary wing parrot or white wing parakeet. He is a small species of bird, but just because he's small in stature doesn't mean that he isn't as intelligent as a larger parrot and he does require a lot of care and a lot of enrichment and foraging opportunities. Um, in case you don't have a parrot, foraging just means the opportunity to search for his food and work for his food. Because he is in a cage all day long, other than when I can take him out, it's really important that I give him things to do throughout the day, just like how I give my dogs their puzzle toys. Atlas really, really enjoys his puzzle toys as well. Um, so one way that we can provide enrichment is just a lot of rotational uh, toys. So I subscribe to this um, subscription box. It's called Squawk Box. I really, really like it. It's a monthly box that we get. Um, it's for different sizes of birds, he obviously gets the smallest one because he is a very small bird. He's only about 65 grams. Um, he's bigger than a parakeet, smaller than a cockatiel. So subscribing to this box has been wonderful because every month we get new toys that he can try out and I like to rotate the toys in his cage several times a week so that he has plenty to do. So without further ado, we're going to open up his box. Are you ready? Right. So this is the squawk box. Ooh. It's February, so it is a Valentine's themed box. Every month it comes with a little card with a recipe on it. Um, this month's recipe uses carob, which is included um, in the box. And carob is not chocolate, it is a chocolate substitute, which he's never had. So we'll see if he likes it. Uh, one thing I do like about this box is it's always packed, packaged with this crinkle paper, which Atlas really, really loves to dig through, and I use it to stuff some of his toys. Let's see. You want to see what's in there? Hi. Good job. You're so smart. You want to sit here? There you go. Good bird. All right, so let's start taking stuff out. The first thing we have is uh, forage-wise. Foraging is fun. stuffable, chewable bags. So apparently you can stuff them full of anything from popcorn to peanuts, cinch the rope, and let the foraging fun begin. Birthday not required. So this looks like cool little paper bags that I can put his seeds in or his daily food or treats, and then tie it closed with this rope that's provided. Um, so that would be an awesome foraging opportunity for him. All right, what do we have next? Isn't he cute? Oh my God, you're so cute. All right. Ooh, what is this? Yay. So this is a flower bouquet. Where are you going? Do you want to come to me? Come to me? Hi. Okay, very good. You're so cute. Do you want to sit with me here? No. There you go. You can go on my shoulder. No, nope, not interested. Okay. So this is the foraging bouquet. Very cute. This kind of thing, I would stick sunflower seeds or other nuts in um, so that he has to pick through this woven basket to get his food out. Absolutely adorable. So cute. All right, what else do we have? Ooh. Oh, he's leaving. This is a Bodacious Bites hardwood uh, dangler with a bell. Pop that open. All right, and this is a colorful dangling hardwood shapes and texture ideal foot and beak exercise toy. So this is just something to hang in his cage, um, provide a little color and texture for him. He's not a big wood chewer, but we'll see. Go. Do you want to sit here? Thank you. You're so smart. All right. All right. Oh, and then we have. Hi. What are you doing? You're worried? 
We have Tail and Treats Carob Chips, which are just made of human grade unsweetened carob powder. Let's try some. All right. Mm -hmm. Do you want to try? I'm going to try. So this is something that is human grade, so you can share with your bird. Do you want to try that? Nope. I'll try it. Mm. You don't want to try that? All right. But well, it tastes pretty good. We have one toy left. Ooh. Come on. Good bird. All right. So last we have this Feathered Addictions little pocketbook with a heart for Valentine's Day. Um, and this kind of toy is awesome for foraging too. I can stick seeds in all these little wrinkles here or put a sunflower seed or two in the basket. It has Chinese finger trap, um, stuff with paper. So I can actually pour a lot of his seed into this little bag and he'll try to rip through to get to it. All right. So this is a great box, Whoop, there we are. Very good uh, value and I would highly, highly recommend anybody that has a parrot and that likes to play with their bird and provide enrichment um, to their bird that you consider getting the squawk box. It's been really fun um, and we're making this late night video because I really wanted to open the box and look through everything and put it in his cage and did not want to wait till tomorrow. All right, thank you, bye, say bye. Whoop. <laughs>